Alrighty, welcome back to Let's Play Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. And when we left it last time, we had beaten up the old guy, the cripple, and the glacier over there. Um, so yeah, without any further ado, 3, 2, 1, and on we go. Just uh, raid the first aid box. Because, uh, yeah, we're going to need it. Give me that boy. It's time to jack up. That's better. <clears throat> now, as I said, we are not going to be fight. Oh, no, 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 no. Just in case something blows up. We're not going to be fighting Marl, nor are we going to be fighting Twitch just yet. Because of reasons. No, because they are going to be very, very tough. And I think it might be an idea to level up a bit. So, let us. Well, let's progress the plot a little bit. That should help with the leveling up thing. Um, let's talk to this random individual who I've never seen before. Hi there. Hello. I haven't seen you around before. Yeah. Of course, they don't give us Sith officers from the military base much time off. Ooh. Let's have a quick drinking game. Every time someone says military base, take a shot. See how you do. Um, so, you're not from the military base. Oh. You don't look like one of the Sith. I'm off duty right now, so I'm not in uniform. My name is Sana, junior officer, first class with the Sith Occupation Force. Not bad. Alrighty, so far so good. Uh, so, nice to meet you, Sana. I'm Granny. I'm actually a little surprised you're talking to me at all. Most of the people here on Taras can't stand us Sith. Well, it can make this job pretty lonely. I can't imagine why. I mean, I'm, I'm sure when the Nazis invaded Poland, people were lining the streets to have a chat to them. Um... See, I'm tempted to go for Persuade, but I'm pretty sure that won't work. Um, that's what I really want to say, but I don't think she'll appreciate it, and uh, I have a feeling that, um, what's the word I'm looking for here? Sweet talking this woman might actually be an idea. So um, we'll go with, I'm not actually from Taris. I'm just stuck here until the quarantine ends. You're an off-worlder. Yep. I figured you'd be even more angry being stuck on a foreign planet and all. Well... Well, you know, being stuck on Taris isn't so bad, but the locals aren't much fun. You know, it's like everyone on this backwater planet is in a permanent bad mood. Don't they know we have to make the best of things? Well, indeed. You've got a pretty positive attitude. Exactly, it's all about attitude. I didn't ask to be assigned to this backwater planet, but right. I try to make the best of it. It's pretty easy to get depressed on an assignment like this, but well, we do what we can to keep our spirits up. Indeed we do. Hey, you need to blow off steam once in a while. That's true. It's nice to meet someone who understands what I'm going through. It's good to talk about this yep. stuff. It gets pretty lonely up at the military base. Mm. I have to get going soon. I've got a ship at the military base. Mm. Some of us junior Sith officers are having a party tonight to blow off some steam. I'd really like to see you again. Why don't you drop by the party? I'll show you where it is on your map. Ooh. We've just been... Look at him. He knows he's just been propositioned. Sounds good. I'll be there. Don't be late. We're starting right after our ship's end. Most of us won't even be going back to the base to lock up our Close up. Oh. I look forward to seeing you there. <laughs> okay, so that was an interesting bit of information, don't you think? They won't even be going back to the military base oh. to lock up their uniforms. And what was it the guy on the... the guard on the lift said? Well, we obviously don't have the papers, but we also don't look like members of the Sith. <laughs> Let us try a bit of subterfuge. And by subterfuge, I mean we're going to go to this party, get them all drunk, and then steal their clothes. Because that's just how heroes roll. I'll be rolling, they be hating. <clears throat> uh, more than that. <sighs> I have to say, though, despite the fact that this is a... Christ, what? what would that be now? A 12 year old game? It, a 12 year old game that was released for the original Xbox it really does not look that bad. I mean, obviously, we haven't got any, we haven't got obviously many different faces on faces that made any sense whatsoever, um, and nor do we have particularly high polygon count um, character models and such like. But, I mean, aesthetically, it 
just looks wide. It looks like a galaxy far, far away a long time ago. Sort of thing. You know what I mean. Okay. It's, uh... Hey, buddies. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. <laughs> so... To the apartments. Yeah, like, I mean, yeah, it's not a bad, just, I don't know, not a bad game, not a bad soundy game either. I mean, it's a pretty decent, um, very sort of Star Wars-esque soundtrack. Hey! Hey, you made it. Absolutely. I you were going to show. The party's in full. Oh, it's going to be a swinging party. You have to try this Teresian ale. It's fantastic. We should have conquered this planet ages ago. Careful, Sana. <laughs> that wine's got quite the kick. Bottles and we'll all be passed out on the floor. Who cares? We're not on duty tomorrow. Let's live a little. Come on, drink up. Ninja! Yeah! God, these Sith pansies cannot hold their drink. Oh, Sana. Sana. You know, if you want my friend, I'd steal your shoes. As it is, I'll just steal the rest of your belongings. Ooh, Sith armor. Now we're talking. Ah, bless him. Although, if I may, now that I think on it, interject just a trifle. Yun, my man, here. What? How to put it? Just because, no, I mean, I don't even know what that kind of put, uh, blah, blah. why can't I speak English? Give me a second. Ah, that's better. Why were the makers of this game so intent on having the Sith be English? I'm not even going to say British, but it's, it's, it's English. Why were they so intent on it that they went to the bother of making the voice actors do absolutely abysmal British, uh, rather English accents. I mean, good lord, are we forgetting? Are we forgetting that Darth Vader, the second most evil person in the galaxy, was voiced by the great James Earl Jones, you know, with a very sort of broad, deep American accent? All the clone troopers were American! Why are all these people English? Gah. Oh well. Let's slip into our disguise. Hmm. Who shall I oppress first? I mean, let's be fair, if I look like a member of a fascist invading army, what's the fun of that if I can't oppress someone? Let's oppress these drunk people. Ooh, hey, look at this. It's shit. <laughs> You should be. Careful. Don't do anything stupid. We don't have no trouble what? Oh, yeah. You're right. But. Sorry about this, shitty. Come on, fellas. But, let's go. But. No! Come back! I want to handcuff you and drag you down an alleyway and beat you to death and then get you nerve stapled or something. <sighs> there is no justice in this world, or this game for that matter. What's the point if I can't oppress someone? I don't know, I could arrest this, maybe I can arrest this guy for being annoying. You. Greetings, my Sith friends. Just assured I have all the proper permits to be here, spreading my message. Feel free permits to denied. If you wish. You'll find my message most enlightening. Duh. Why can't I oppress people? Me, oh, shut up, you crank. Hey, brother. Another patrol heading down to the lower city, eh? Yep. Well, good luck. I've heard it's pretty rough down there. Mm -hmm. There's a big swoop gang war going on, you know. You watch yourself. Those gangs will take a shot at anyone. Even really? Us. It's too 
glad we don't have the manpower just to sweep those slums clean. <laughs> that sound like, that, that sounds like an opportunity to uh, to obtain a vast number of experience points. <laughs> yeah, but uh, even so, let's just switch back. No sense in needlessly antagonizing people. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Mm, it should be interesting. Be interesting. Pigs are nothing but panther fodder. The Vulcars are strongest. Oh, <clears throat> that's gonna screw up my throat. We'll teach you who's strongest. We'll teach you who's strongest by dying. Ha ha! Yeah, the people's front of Judea. Oh, is that the Judean people's front? Or oh, the people's Judean front? Well, one of them. More strangers! Sorry. Oh, well, anyway, yes. Ay ay ay. Black Vulgar. <laughs> oh. That's what you get. Look at that. Yoink! Alright. Nothing like some experience points. <laughs> That's all these people are to me. Walking sacks of leveling up opportunities. Let's look this dude. Ooh, med pack might be very useful. Volcar Guard. Time to make this Volcar Guard a Volcar Corpse. <laughs> oh, yeah, boy. Oh, that was embarrassing. Ah. Cuff! He was two inches in front of you. How did you miss him? Yeah. Alright. Oh, good God. Shush how much I was paying attention. I didn't realize I was almost dead. Oops. Um. But anyway, yes, welcome to Lower Terrace. What? what? Oh, wrong button. That was the button. No, that still wasn't the button. That was the button. Uh, Lower Terrace Apartments, Upper City, to the Black Volcar Base. Yeah, probably don't want to try and break into there just yet. Oh, no, that wasn't the button. Good lord, how am I doing? No, oh, I'm just about to level up. Let's just explore this corridor for a bit. Again! You know, it looks like Taris, I guess, and it looks run down. Wonderful art direction and design and general, you know, aesthetics in this game. Ooh, more experience points! I changed my mind. Disengage. wasn't important. <laughs> well, he had money on him, so, you know, it was a, a good thing. Oh, good God. Yeah, let's uh, do that again. I really need... Ooh, hello, this looks like a, a cutscene. You guys are behind with your payments. Mm -hmm. You uh, you think just because you're in some gang, you don't have to give Davik his cut? Davik, you say? I don't see Gavik, uh, Davik doing anything for his share. We do all the work. Davik claims he's part of the exchange, so let's see him prove it. That's the smartest thing you've ever done there, son. Yeah, let's see the big crime lord come and get his money from the black Volcars. This is because their eyes are black. Yeah. Mm. Ah, so you want to play this the hard way? <laughs> okay. Ooh. Nietzsche. Oh, hey, Andres. We, uh, we didn't know you was working for Davik now. Were you fool? Yeah, we were just goofing around here. Eh? Yeah, don't want no trouble with that Mandalorian. Here's Davik's gut. I knew you boys would see reason. Now get out of here. Too bad. Hmm. I was looking forward to cracking some heads. Well, Maybe next time, Candrus. I better get this over to Davik. 
I'll call you if anyone else gets behind on their payments. Yeah, fascinating. Well, he has an, he has a name and an original face, so he must be someone worth talking to. Those Valkyries hey, are dumber than a chorus and granite slug. Well, indeed. They actually think being in that pathetic little gang of theirs makes them important. <laughs> Gaddon cool. keeps his hidden Vex in line, but Brezik's getting dreams of grandeur. If Davik's smart, he'll slap that young punk back down. Ooh. Who are you? I'm someone you don't want to get on the bad side of. Fair enough. And I'm not one for small talk. Okay. I don't have time to stick around here anyway. Davik's got me working on a special assignment. <laughs> wow, that was an awful lot of information you just dropped for precisely no reason whatsoever. Hmm. Let's carry on looking this way, though. Volcar and Fulsa. He's a... Whoa. I take that back. Oh, oh yeah! Oh, I thought it was gonna be a multi kill. How'd you like that? Ooh. How'd you like that? Oh. 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 How could you possibly miss him from behind? How'd you like that? Sweet patootie. <sighs> Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, let's not go that way. What? Alright. We should probably get healed though. Sure. There we go. Um actually, uh there we go. I don't know, actually, I don't think I've ever done it before. Let's uh walk up there in a ye oldie Sith armor and see what happens. Blast a turret, blast a turret, blast a turret. Bored dude. That way. This area is restricted to undercity patrols. Oh. Without the proper security papers, I can't let you pass. Hmm. Uh, that's the point. I'll be going now. Good. I don't have time for this foolishness. Down here, we run a tight ship. Not like the slipshot operations in the upper city. Ooh. Wow. So, where is this heading? To undercity. All right. That may be important in the future. Not now, you understand, but in the future. Alright, let's quickly change out of that. Alright. And get going. Hmm. How are we doing for time? 18 and a bit minutes. Coming up. Well, I'll come up to 18 minutes. Hmm. Hang on, what's that way? There's more apartments. Yeah, lower city parts. Don't want to go there. What am I doing? That? I've got a map here. Okay. Wow. Oh, actually, I think this might be a convenient moment. Um. Yeah, that's the hidden back base. See, it says hidden back base. Um. A, a bouncer. Yeah. I'm not too worried. Jaffiar's Cantina. Now that sounds like a place to visit. So, um. Yeah. Only up to Grand Total 6, so Grand Total 7. Finally making progress. Happy days all round. Okay, um. So, yeah, uh, until next time, keep on gaming in the free world. Sludge Nazi, we've Decepticons before. Nazi again, either, because we dynamite them to pieces.